Right then, welcome back. Race two of our little uh, three event Italian Supersport 500cc Championship Cup, whatever we are calling it. Um, and we are on the 1969 MV Augusta 500cc 3 Agostini. Um, Monza went better than I thought. The bike actually handled reasonably well. The AI weren't great. Yes, we only have an 85%. However, this is the first time we've raced on that difficulty setting and had a big lead. So we'll leave it where it is because I have a funny feeling when we get to the 600cc Super Sports, it's going to be, oh, it's going to be absolute carnage. Um, I guess I better save uh, this setup because... Um, it's wiped it so we'll uh, we'll go through and do it again shall we one that needs to be four that needs to be two oh, the transmission isn't it weird that it's a seven speed gearbox but you can't adjust seventh um, I felt like the gear ratios were a bit low so you know we'll save that done um, we can't choose tyres oh we can so we're going to go softs. I forgot we're on race tyres. I thought we were on the standard ones. Um, and that's it. We shall leave it there and we'll see how we get on. I was completely unaware that there were any patterns in this race until I just saw that. Really? Really? That was a bit weird, wasn't it? So we went. And then we'll skip that. So we went, and then it kicked itself into neutral, and then we didn't go. Hmm. Interesting. But I'm on a guest bike that can't be tuned. No, you... And that is what winds me up. You touch them. You touch them anywhere, and you're off. You can smash into them left right and center it doesn't matter how hard you hit them and they never fall off and it is absolutely ridiculous if we're going to fall off when we have contact then make everybody the same a much better start although now we're on a curve that's going to push us wide come on oh no penalty oh no we're going away with that AI lap times from uh, what is it, Alex Massetti, the Italian. He's deter. Oh, I thought they were going to get a touch there off Newman. So we've got a Brazilian out front now, not Italian. But the Italian's behind us, who was leading last time. Again, pushing that front end. Come on, mate, don't take the piss. supposed to be on equal machinery but you're about to see how equal it is down the straight
got to rewind. He has to rewind. Where did he get that traction from? And that drive, that was ridiculous. Ah, that penalty running out of there every time. mistake then we're going to be off they're going to take such weird lines there'll be a massive amount of blocking going on as well so round the outside that would have been absolutely ridiculous we have the problem when we get to the straight he's just going to vanish because apparently his MV is an absolute missile whereas ours isn't again oh, we're gonna have to do it dirty aren't we we're gonna have to do it dirty I don't mind but it's just not well, it's just not very nice. Plus, if we're not if far enough in front when we get to the last corner, we're going to get annihilated down the straight anyway. Oh, I made a mess of that. I looked up at the gap. good speed through there especially through that first bit come on don't get on the gas too early I don't know if that's a big enough gap plus we've got a 1.3 well yeah, 1.3 tenths. That's wide, it won't stop. I think that's enough. I think... Yes, 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 yes. There we go, we're done. That was an absolute pain in the arse. And we set exactly the same lap time, 206.794. The leaderboards for this are absolutely empty as well. There's nobody, nobody doing laps on it because it's, what, 600,000 credits or something stupid? Oh, well. Right, done. That gives us, hopefully, 50 points in total. Um, I'm not quite sure who's second in the championship. We'll have a look in a little while. But I will as always, leave you with the replay um, and hopefully we can do just as well, where's the last one? Oh, it's at Imola isn't it? Oh, it's going to be an absolute nightmare, it's going to be an absolute nightmare going to Imola um, but hopefully that goes as well as this one did and we can win it 
and win the championship and move on and race some proper bikes because I won't lie I am not a massive fan of the older stuff I think it's a bit pointless and I only think it's in because Milestone is an Italian company but hey that's just my opinion so it doesn't really matter um, but right that's it um, fingers crossed um, you will join me next time uh, when we do the last race so hopefully I'll see you then take care stay safe peace